So here we are able to use the zoom lock tool on this branch box. All you have to do is cut off these ends right here and then put your, you know, prep the fit in, clean it, and then we're able to put these specified zoom lock valves that Mitsubishi approved. Um, and then crimp right to it and then go out to each of our, our pipe runs. Here you can see we added the valve for the seventh port if we ever want to add an additional indoor unit. Uh, we were able to just add a little chunk of pipe and put the cap right on so if we do want to add we can just valve off and then make a cut and add our next run. This really makes it simple for any additional systems we might add in the future so we're just kind of prepping ourselves for future work. We are still able to use the zoom lock to add for the run going up to the rooftop, the outdoor unit. It was a little bit more hard. We did have to do a couple brazes here. But once we kind of got the, the, the stick of pipe sticking out, we are able to use the zoom lock again. So it was a very minimal brazing. As you can see here, I mean, we had one, two, three brazes is all we had to do. And then we could go right to the zoom lock going to the rooftop unit. So out at this job site, we've not really had to braze anything on this whole city multi-system. We were able to pretty much just cut off these little caps here and, and this guy here. And then once you clean up the fitting, you're really able to use this zoom lock right off the, the indoor unit. This is a ducted uh, indoor, I think it's a three-ton system. Uh, the biggest thing is on this insulation here, there's a sticky back that they use. You really got to push that off with your finger. Uh, the sand cloth and stuff like that really does not get it off. So you really, that's the only thing that's kind of a pain. But other than that, it's really easy and quick. Uh, not having to use any brazing has been absolutely awesome on this job. So honestly, if you want to save a bunch of time doing any of these ductless systems, whether it's a M series or a P series, Mitsubishi, Daikin, or any of the other brands, or any of these city multi-systems, it can save a tremendous amount of time and you don't have to worry about brazing or anything like that or fire watch or anything like that when you're on some of these bigger sites. I would highly, highly recommend the zoom lock. We've already done a couple city multi-systems and had no leaks whatsoever with it. Um, I, I highly recommend the product of zoom lock.